Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Wolferton here, and welcome back to another new nation's perspective in Thousand Week Right. As per one of the um different views, perspectives, and one of my viewers wanting me to do a different country, this time I'll try to make sure I get Henry the Seventh, no Henry the Sixth of France, back into power as a monarch of France. Now let's go. Although, I have to do say, please bear in mind, I really haven't played played much of Thousand Week Reich or know how the French Focus Tree works before playing this, but I actually want to give this myself as a challenge try, to try to get Henry the Sixth. So with that out of the way, and with careful planning, I might just get him. So we start off with Max Maxime Weigand. So, alright. We start off with a broken French nation. Three republics, two empires, three monarchies, who knows how many revolt, revolts and revolutions. To say France's history has been tumultuous can be a bloody understatement. It is a bloody understatement indeed when some people think about it. So let's see, the state of affairs. But never in this history it has been bad as a state for now with France. Okay, so we have different political focus trees. We have a different national focuses for it. Well, I'm not really sure how I'm going to get Henry the Sixth, But oh well, as they say, temporary tax hike. To facilitate our coming reforms to get France back on its feet, we need additional funds. Some members of the government have suggested a temporary tax hike to, ass to, to assertion these times. Our population will not be happy though, but when does our population not have something to complain about these days? Mm-hmm. Meet with the right meet with the Empire Verte. In recent years we've been been successful in gaining certain concessions to the right lifted. Ending the German occupation of the North was a particularly difficult process to finalize. Even now, German garrisons still remain. Perhaps we can agree on more lenient terms. Hopefully the Reich is willing to listen. Ooh, rumors of a resistance. It seems the French, the free French resistance, is still troubling the French nation. Oh boy, the new MAS. And normally I would love to do many invasions, but I feel so constricted. I don't know why, but I could make a foreign foreign investment away and gain back Syria. Gain back national pride for for the French Empire. Hmm. I think I just found myself a new... Oh, the Socialist Republic of Bengal and India signed the White Peace. How ironic. The Bengal Truce. The Bengal War. Death of... Yeah, I'm not even gonna say that. Egyptian Martial Law, Indonesian National Revolution, Death of some Finnish President. Oh uh, no, Iceland President. Goodbye, old man. Oh, Confeder the Confederation Kingdom of Netherlands and Indonesia declared war on the Republic of Indonesia. Peace at last in subcontinent of India? Maybe. I don't know. No one cares. Syrian National State. Hmm. Dream of a Greater Syria. You know what? I might as well make some good trickery offshore back with Syria. I think I just gave myself a new idea. And here we are. We now started started a war with with Syria. 
because I really want to I really want to gain back French national pride no matter how much long it takes and I'm starting off with eight soldiers under oh death of King George the sixth the king is dead long live the queen Huh. And I'm doing the invasion under this guy, Henry Marie, uh, Henry Henry Marie Charles Charles Adelin. Man, I, and I thought German names were hard to pronounce. Also, there's the death of Rallis. Oh, Aeonis Rallis of Greece has been assassinated during a speech. That's the last straw for Greece. <laughs> last straw indeed. I don't know how the Greece would even survive in that new plethora of times. I feel sorry for him. Take all the state. Mm -hmm. Fate of Syria and Lebanon. <laughs> Install. Tax hike completed. Oh, Germany tests an atomic bomb? We'll see about this. Install a loyal Lebanese state. Install a loyal regime in Syria, and yeah. This is, this is nice, but let me change something a bit. There we go. Much better. A Syrian, a Syrian republic under a military junta, paternal autocrat. France will be. France will have its loss avenged. In no time. Let's see. Whispers of resistance. Since the earliest days of our occupation, the French resistance started cropping up left, right, and center. Over the years, in cooperation with our German allies, we have extinguished these, these kind of free Frenchy. I'm not even going to save a T word here. But rumors, but rumors still persist. Ooh, the Norwegian fall, surprising. But the rumors yet persist of midnight meetings, scufflings in the sewers, and odd, odd shot in night. Best keep these quiet. Or the Germans will never leave. Agricultural reforms meet with the Reichsviata. All right. What now? Oh, some guy wins the Finnish presidency. Oh, oh dear lord. A fa a fascist in Finland. Oh boy, seems like Finland is going to be in for a rough time. Now I feel sorry for the Greeks and the Finnish at this point. I don't know why, but it feels like I want to get involved with the Kingdom of Morocco and annex Morocco for itself. Only a few days after the start of a Morocco run, protesters have start appearing in Algiers in larger numbers. When one domino falls, the other follows suit. I know this will be a harsh reality for me, but... When, but if things do start to happen, I will try to reclaim back Algeria and even a lot more than this. The French authority? Hmm. Let's see, this one's... Let's see, this one's gonna be a crazy time. We must fight against the French colonists to gain our freedom. We can only stand in horror and watch. The die is already casted. At least I still have French Syria. That's that's fine. Ooh, we can assist Oran. The 
The Question of the Saharas. The Council of Sahara exists. The effect selected. Oh boy. Meet with the Reichs of Yata. Britain tests its own nuclear bomb. Oh boy, they need to be exterminated. This is not going well. Now you're thinking I could have at least just wanted to fight digni fight with digni dignity, right? Well, to be honest, not really. I mean, it's easy for me to just cut my losses earlier just to gain them back in a later day. Quizzling wins the struggle? Not surprising. Not surprising in the least. No. Ooh, Leverenti Beria died. Thank god. Ah, you know what? Screw it. I can't deal with this. Okay, there. Now we have. Now we're giving Oran support, and I mean that we're giving the support to them directly. With the Oran Free State, that's fine, buddy. Shady dealings in the right. Intriguing. Independent diplomatic ties. Konev is declared premier. It was a nice talk. France foreign offices have been very little to do in recent years, with almost all their decisions being made by the Reich. Foreign relations are limited to those within or associated with the pact, and some within the Toronto Accords don't even recognize their government as legitimate. Perhaps we should make some approaches to the Toronto Accords and see if an arrangement can be reached. Well I well I sure do hope that it does that it does succeed. See war bonds. Oh, time to get more land. The RSS defeated. Let's hope this ends in the violence. Final. Uh -huh. We just got back the part we needed. The question of the Saharas. Alright. Reform the Officer Corps. If anyone can be blamed for the defeat of 1940, our officer corps is top of the list. Gam Gamelin, the old fool, didn't have a radio in his headquarters. Men like him still remained in our high command. These men must be sidelined. Of course, Le Chief did his best. The technology marches forward. The Havilland Comet debuts in the May Day Revolution in Japan. Wait, a social... Uh, is it just me or am I getting like always a May Day socialist Japan? Like... Ooh, now we got an independent Egypt. Seems like there's another country to be on the French invasion list. Attention, Attention professor. Yeah, that was a bit of French there. As a matter of fact, I don't even know French, but... It's actually nice to know only slightly few words. China denounces Vietnam. 
Defy a lucky. Finally. Oh. I can't take all the states. Mm-hmm. Reunion independence. A new nation. Oh, a new nation in a Asia? I gotta see this new nation. Oh. Okay, I see. Makes sense. The Iran Free State. Let's see. It says here, with the Iran Free State victory in the war, French will now call the domain over Algeria. Well, once again, a home away from home is what they say. It's a miracle job landing us. Now it's up to the most desirable to embrace them. Fold for, oper for occupation would be a costly affair. If we're in for a penny, a heavy hand is what led us here. A heavy hand is what led us here. Political power. Mm-hmm. The disillusion of the Sahara. A heavy hand is what led us here, but however, I might just have to change some things. And here we are, a United French Administration of Algeria. I don't know why, but it's still like, but it feels like I still want to get involved with Morocco. Out of heck with it, you know what, I'm going to get involved with Morocco's war. Korean protest crush, change is not always easy. The Malayan Emergency, another crack in the British Empire? How unfortunate. Time for Morocco to get back into the fold. By the French. Morocco is rightfully fr part of the Fr French Empire. Alright, finally. Mm -hmm. The fate of Morocco. Spain may enjoy their victory for now, but it felt more like a French victory. Liberate Morocco. Basically. However, no clear winner in the UK? Wait, wait, well, hold on. There's no clear winner in the UK for the next elections? Well, that just got concerning. However, for Morocco, I'm going to have to do a simple trick. And there we go. Reform we have finally reformed the officer corps. Civil unrest in Bulgaria. We shall hire new talent. Recruitment drive. As the restrictions of our nation are slowly lifted, a new recruitment drive must be enacted. Our army is barely big enough to control our unruly population, let alone fight a war. I expect, I expect most wouldn't be surprised if Spain could defeat our army. Mm-hmm. Yep, and now I got two colonies. The, the Syrian Republic and the French administration of Algeria. All I need left is Tunisia back into the fold. And I despise the Italians for taking Tunisia. But I could oh, declare war on the free city of Mauritania. And I might as well try to get some land out of them. We don't we no longer get the tax hike. A divided military. Under the early terms of occupation, the French army was disarmed with personal which personnel dismiss or place into forceful retirement. During this time, the French state maintained a bare-bones military apparatus before being able to renegotiate terms with the German authorities for a proper reformation of its military. 
Hmm. With both radical pro pro German and former fighters and crypto revolutionaries together in the same group. Wow. War reparations. The Germany. It seems like our second armistice with France. We have to pay vast sums of money to Germany and will take full responsibility for the losses of on the Western Front. The war reparations are expected to expire by as late twenty ten, the late two thousands. Now, where have this? Now, where have that term seemed familiar? Hmm. Coincidence? I think not. Let's see. I got the I got the Syrian I got the Syrian Republic, the PPS elected. Oh, cool. Oh. Like I said, I'm trying to get to the monarchist Henry the Six. So. Anyone who might see that any mistake I made, please bear with me, because um, the end result may not be something that I really try to get completed. Limited rearmament, and once again, as the French army grows slowly under the hawkish observers of Verreich, but growing nonetheless, just as the Germans did, we shall rise from the ashes like a phoenix, with the army leading the way. Novazo burst, declared war on Krasnoyark. You know, maybe with the German Civil War, I might as well try to take take back some land from here, like um, like Lorraine, Fr French Comte, and ooh, and Auslas. Time to get the, time to get those territories back into the motherland. Assuming that is, of course, if I also help the Swiss, the Belgians, and the Netherlands get into their fight. Because I want to get my land back as much as they do. Alright. Time for some research. What now? Japanese anarchists take over? Oh god, no. A radical change. Domestic designs, the Republic of Ch The Sino-Japanese War. Yeah, Greece can fight its own problems. I'm not interested in theirs. Hmm. Wow. The Kingdom of Belgium really, ha really, ha really handled the Pan-African Front really well. Can't say I'm surprised. Whoa. A revolution in Bulgaria? Oh, it's the Tsardom of Bulgaria under Nikolai Mikovic. Wow. A new start. Ethiopian Uprising? Interesting. I'm not sure if I should get in on this action. Einstein visits Israel, of course, and we all know what happens next. And we all know what happens next, like... Einstein dies in Israel. It's, it's not going to be surprising. The Righteous in Sweden? Under Jarl Hajmal Marsen. Like I said, some of these leaders' names are hard to spell, even in a native language. Agricultural reform. The only wealth we possess is our labor. France will become again what should never have seized to be an essentially agricultural nation. The late Philippe, Philippe Petain said of our sovereign, sovereign state, Since the early days of the Vichy regime, Germany has demanded an extortionate amount rate of agricultural goods from us. Food shortages have become an average part of life from, for most now. The system needs immediate reform. We don't know how much more our population can take this. Mm-hmm. We better, we better at least make sure that we... Well... Alleviate the food shortage before things get worse for us. And I mean that literally. Also, I think it's time for us to get Mauritania back into the fold. 
Here we go. Hmm. Oh, good. U.S. tests its hydrogen bomb, a really terrifying weapon. Uh-huh. And the Republic of Mauritania is now under the French thumb once again. Domestic changes. Truman elected as president. Four more years of President Truman. The government Francois. The French government. Oh boy. Marxist Leninists. The Free French Resistance. FRN. Equistoriot. Oh boy. That's a lot of parties. Good, I can still try to research important stuff. Uh -huh. Okay, we start up the factories. Due to our economic spiral down to collapse again and again, many factories have been put out of business. Mass unemployment followed, then crime skyrocketed like crazy. With the economy slowly stabilizing, mostly, it is time to get these workers back to doing just that. Working. U.S. criticizes Ch Middle Congo joins the Commonwealth, and the U.S. condemns the Chinese invasion of Vietnam. Not surprising. And besides, most of his pop- most of- okay. The general strike. We have handled. We have to handle this. The new MAS. Owing to the limitations placed on our forces after the humiliation of 1940, some within our army have turned to more, how you say, uh, radical and experimental military ideas. The Italian modo scapo arma, armato silurante or MAS. Turkestani Civil War? Yeah, yeah, I get it. Compromising small elite units, it is perfect for us to develop among the limitations of our forces. We shall strive to copy and improve upon the Italian ideas. Handling the laborers. Oh, that was quick. Why is it our population loves a strike? Since the days of the Industrial Revolution, worker unions have enacted strike after strike after strike. If the factories are going to start up again, we must bring the unions to the table. The compromise with the Reich allowed our survival. Compromise with the un unions may allow us to grow again. Okay, so I see. It's like being between a rock and a hard place for France, between the trade unions and the Reich. I can see why. I can see why they're basically like this. Harry Truman inaugurated, what a show, yada yada yada. Hmm. Sorry, Italy, but I think France will need the Middle East for this one. The Republic of Indonesia and Netherlands signed the White Peace. Also, I don't get in the scene for Komazar Caucasus. Why would the state of Georgia and Armenia be independent? Like, I don't get- oh, Jesus, the Turkestani nation really is going downhill. But also, Turkestan dissolved, it shouldn't be a surprise. Okay, economic reforms. I'm doing this as quickly as possible, people. Stagnation, inflation, recession. In the last few years, they have been all you would see when analyzing Negotiate with them. In the last few years, these have been all you would see analyzing our broken system in the economy. At the turn of a decade, the first signs of economic recovery appeared. 
At last, genuine reform can finally take shape in our broken country. Oh, damn! Oh. oh, dear lord, now we come to this. Ante Pavlik assassinated. Oh, boy. Seems like there's some major stuff going down. Exp hmm. The death of Wayguard. Chaos in the capital. Declaring New France. Order is restored. The French Revolution. Sideline the Socialists. Hmm. You shall complete the focus death of Wayguard or. The revolution begins. Hmm. I'm not really sure what. Like I said, I'm not really sure which one to do because I'm not going to be able to get to the monarch focus tree for this one. So this one's going to be a tough, but I'll try to go with the latter option. Offers Paris riots. God damn it. Hmm. We accept their peace. The riots spread. Okay, put the get get this out of control. The Grand Funeral. Holy shoot. And it's a good thing I wanted to join the Mediterranean Pact. Because I really needed it. Now here's a second. Doriot declares a new France. The, P the PPF becomes a new ruling party. Let's see, French resistance, civil military, French commune. Yeah, yeah, I would say no. Order restored. Yeah. Purge the fa We shall purge El Fascist. Many in French resistance moves now interest in incurring German favor, and then they were battered battering the French nations, we cannot have these traitors continue to exist in our body politic. Crusade against the French ultra-right. Hmm. Now this is something. It's a good thing too that I joined, like I said, Italy's faction. <gasps> oh my god! It's finally been done! I never actually thought I'd see the day where they actually had the Japanese Emperor executed. They executed the Imperials. They're going too far, man. I tell you, man, they're going too far. <laughs> Helicopter engines. Jesus Christ. Ukrainian collapse and then Moscow is going to collapse. Everything's going to collapse. The, the, the SNCAN Nord 1700 Norlick helicopter. We shall learn about the jet engine. Huh? What's this? The socials? Oh.
Crusade against the Ultra French Right. And hope they like their vacations in Frankfurt. Break up the resistance. DNA structure, Bosnia. The French resistance has been a foreign on our side since the war. We cannot have these saboteurs attack us in the building of a new France. We will spare no expense in exercising this right threat. I don't know why I just said that. Burn the not burn the sympathizers. And we shall hunt down the Dorians. Mm-hmm. Yep, they have no su they have no support left for them. The German New Order Alliance is just crumbling. Moscow was already in the mess, Ukraine as well, the Caucasus. I don't think they're gonna be rising back up anytime soon, so I think later on I'll just bide my time and wait. Oh great, another civil war in Indochina? Kamput versus- oh. This time it's actually led by two Samufa. Is this the end of resistance? Mm -hmm. And our government will now no, no such subversion. Authority restored. Our rule is now more secure than ever. Coronation of Queen Elizabeth II. Germans crushing the Ukraine. Dang, how is... How... I didn't even know Dernus is actually the new... The new... The new leader now? Oh boy. Am I in for a rough time or what? Oof, never mind. Haha. <laughs> The German Civil War. The Burger Krieg starts. The moment I've been waiting for. <laughs> the Netherlands under Hank Feldmajer is independent. That's good. Hmm. Eliminate the terrorists. Uh, I don't get it. That that just this just doesn't seem right. Like, come on. Really? The Slovak uprising and every nation falls again and yada yada yada. I get it. E eliminate the communist terror. Clear out seven. You've got to be kidding me. And I don't want to see- And I don't want to see the uh, the Orden stat really bordering me like that's just gonna mess everything up. I don't want them to be like my new neighbors like. It's just giving me unedged nerves. Ooh, the Southern Spring. Here come the Poles now. Dang. A unification of Greater Romania. Dang, the German spear is just getting is just getting beaten back left, right, and sideways. I really feel sorry for the Germans. Not Great, another civil war again. Hm. I'm just standing here watching all this border gore just go down. Like, my god.
but I do want some factions to win, though. I don't want to see a repeat of the Southwest Red Army coming out. It's, it's too common. Like, um, there. Like, I want the National Republic of Ukraine to win. Like, at least in some sense they understand. Or at least this one, the Western Ukrainian Front. A Hungarian coup in... Oh, Miklas Horthy still retains his power! Oh, nice. The Danish Revolution? A Social Democratic Denmark appears, hooray! Seems like... A Seems like order is being restored everywhere in Europe. The return of Brazilian stability. Authority is restored. A modern republic. Oh, another coup in Romania? No, I know. The Social French Order? I don't know how I feel about that one. Anyway, lads and lasses and everyone else, this is where I'm going to have to stop for now for the French state in episode 1 and its perspective. As you can tell, I already joined the Mediterranean pack, got... French Syria back into the fold, but also had to loot, sacrifice some land in most of my earlier French col French African colony, but I still retained Oran as a French administration of Algeria, so that's at least two pl three plus sides up. Anyway, I'll see you guys and ladies and everyone else next time for the second episode. So stay cool, and never ever stop questioning what ifs.